much for if I've told you or not, but it's the biggest game of the tournament and probably of the year. GB against South Korea. All of South Korea's games have been against easy teams, but they've made the most of their scoring chances because in both of their games they got seven goals. And uh, in one of the games the other team only got one goal, in the other game they, they got three. So South Korean goalie, not very good at high glove and high stick, I don't think. So, um, and he's not good at anywhere when shots are fast. It's going to be a really big game. I think, I hope GB can do this. The two teams that have won two games out of two games. South Korea, they are the favourites. I was expecting a GB win. It all started with, G with South Korea leading 1-0, then 2-0. But like the game against Croatia, they came back and tied it. And it was 1-0 one, it was one nil, and then 2-0 to South Korea. And then GB got one goal, then they got another, but then it was hard to call. South Korea got a penalty and a bad one because it got a penalty shot as Ben O'Connor took it. He scored and the score was 3-2 and that lasted through the period as GB won the game. extremely excited and extremely impressed that GB actually held, held their lead. That's all they needed to do to win the game and they did it and they won the game. because he went in the penalty shot that he scored it was a really good goal wow it was a really good goal i don't think i could i could even go high <laughs> very excited i was very surprised too because i thought the goalie saved it um probably gb now that they've beaten South Korea, who are the heavy favourites, but now, now GB are the heavy favourites, and I don't think anyone can beat them. Two more wins. If they win against these two teams, they would win gold, surely. 